What do you call a criminal landing an airplane? Condescending. Get it? Because he's a con and he's also descending. <laughs> Welcome back to GTA 4. This episode, I started off by opening up my emails. Because Mili Kabeli, dear Mili Kabeli, has replied to us. Thankfully, we can reply back this time because in the previous one, we did not. So I'm going to read what she said and then I am going to do a stranger interaction um, that I can do now. And then oh, oh, hopefully I can spawn it anyway. Um, and then continue on from where we last left off. So stay tuned for that. Like, subscribe. Let's get into it. My dearest son, I was thinking about you and I thought I write. I received nice email from your cousin. He said you had seen Florian Kravich again. Did he become a professional wrestler, as he say? He was always strange, boy. Roman also tell me he has a woman nice in his life, and that maybe there's someone special for you too. Life here is much same. Crops grow, the country flounders, British people come to buy holiday, homes they never visit. That is so true. <laughs> The politician, the politician argue, as we all want things will change. I have long memory, life always confusing, uncertain. Only problems change. We have never known freedom or nor democracy. Sometimes I think this makes realistic life easier for us. In America, I imagine the people must be bitter. The world used to love the, huh? The world used to love. What? The world used to love the now they are despised. I thought I was reading that wrong for a second. The president Lawton seems like a foolish man. Have you met him, Roman? <laughs> of course, you go to a different country. Of course you meet the president. <laughs> Roman said that you are that you and him were up for a prestigious award and you had some powerful friends. Your loving mother. Mother. <laughs> I love how she ends it like that. Dear mother, thanks for your email. Life in America is okay. Thank you for your concern. I wish Roman would join me for his time spent living in clouds. He makes things up. I don't know why. He has a nice woman in his life. That is true. The rest is lies. <laughs> Apart from Florian Krevich, he has, he have seen him. He is very different. Oh yes, he is. Okay. I thought some news article would pop up about the serial killer, but would they have known it's him? Probably not, um, even if I killed him. All right, shut up, your mouth. Uh, I'm going to go now and um, try to get right here where, um, where this marker is, just because this is where uh, supposedly this quite it's almost the last random character could potentially spawn so i'll try and get there you know meet you guys in a sec oh bernie's calling what's up bernie i want you to give her something to say thank you for me and brian well he doesn't know i'm giving you this but he gave it to me so it's technically from him what is it Enjoy. oh i only power walk but take cab so i figured i should pass this on to my stay hell yeah Thanks, man. I appreciate that. For Don't sure! What we've got is worth more than money. Okay, and where would I know? Oh, okay, I can go to his and then I can take the car. Okay, I am just at my penthouse? Or I don't even know where the entrance is. I think it's that thing. Yes. Um, just because uh, I need to spend some time sleeping, <laughs> basically. So I'll meet you guys in a sec. Oh, there she is. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't know what I did. I didn't think she would spawn, but I kept trying to hang around here to see if she would. And she did, so. Man, oh man. Man, oh man, are you my best friend? I see you did nothing else. <laughs> hey, mister. Yes? Hey, mister. You got, got some junk? Oh, what's happened to no. you? Shit. Oh, she's a I'm drunkie. You know, he's starting to do pretty bad. How old are you? Old enough. No. Oh, no, God. Dead? Huh. Ain't you got a home or something? Ain't you got a life? Or do you always have to interfere in other people's? I'm sorry. See you later. Hey, God. Mister, come back here. 
I'll fuck you for five bucks. No! What's wrong with you? I need junk. I need money. You shouldn't be fucking strange men for money. I'll give you some money. I need junk. More than money. Oh, God. I know a place where we can Will get some. Will you take me there, mister? Please. Do we have a choice? <laughs> Come on, then. Come on, then. He's so gullible. He's over on Car Square. No, okay. Come on, Dan, Marnie, to the dealers. God, she seems young and she's already using drugs. What uh, an unfortunate life she's got, right? I'm not sure if this is, if this has two encounters. I don't think he has three. Maybe. Why don't you ease up on this stuff? Go to a center, get yourself clean. You don't yeah. want a substance controlling your life. What the fuck? People just try to tell me what to do. Go to school, read this, practice that, suck these. I hate everyone. Just, just leave me the fuck alone. Leave you alone so you can sell your ass for some junk? Yeah, yeah. well, I'm happy where I am. I was, you know. at least. Mm -hmm. My habit was five bags a day I could survive off panhandling. If you can't get the money together, then maybe you should cut back on your habit. I can get the money together. It just I takes a little improvisation, sure like finding you in the park. I knew you'd help me. How? I don't know. Something in your eyes. You look like you've got a good heart. I don't know about that. You do? Always the people Most tell him that. Those guys would've fucked me and left me by the side of the road already. You're nice. What's your name? Nico Belli. Nice to meet you, Nico. I'm Marnie. Man. I'm jonesing. Hard. Fuck, can you stop moving, cars? This shit is in control. Turn into some methadone zombie? I don't think so. I quit. I do it cold turkey and by myself. Not that I want to quit. I'm Why? having too much fun. How are you you seem to be having a great time. God, she definitely makes me feel bad for herself. Um, I would never touch any like hard drugs because I have an addictive personality, and this will be me. Um, I mean, I don't know, because I'm pretty strong-willed, so who knows, um, but it, it's, you know, I, I feel for people, because some people don't have a choice in, in the matter, like, they grew up, you know, with their parents being drug dealers and doing all sorts of shit, and basically letting them down, even since they were born, um, so that's really not a good thing. And, you know, you can only sympathize and you really just have to understand that for some people, this is not a choice. I, I think I watch too much uh, Soft White Underbelly here on YouTube. I don't know if you guys know about the channel. It's quite big um, now, but I found it. I wouldn't, it, it had a couple of thousand and the guy just did, does interviews mainly f um, with Kid Row guys. Oh my God, I didn't even touch that thing. Hey, this is it. You got the cash? Here you go. Good luck to you, kid. You need it. Thanks, Nico. You're real sweet. Hmm. Shame. I was just thinking, oh, if they, the dealers pop up, maybe I, we could shoot them. And... Sorry, <laughs> I didn't even see you, man. <laughs> yeah, I thought we could shoot them and... Uh whatever but we didn't so okay um okay now literally we are gonna do this we're gonna do this mission i keep saying for the past like three episodes oh, i'm gonna do it and something always comes in all right maybe it's just not meant to be maybe if something does come up <laughs> and i can't do it ah what the fuck car and i can't do it now either then that means it's like written in the stars what do we... Oh, okay, I was about to say, do we have to illegally come here to do this mission? But they opened it up, so it's fine. I can't remember. I think we need to meet him because he's got a job for us or something like that. I think. So, let's see. Truck hustle. Oh, we have to steal trucks or something? Uh-huh. That thing? Our friend did what? 
37 and 8? No. Nah. <laughs> what about them swingers? How's Marlene? The kids? Beautiful. Okay. Yeah, I gotta go. Let's chop. Hey, Ray. So, uh, who's the pal? Phil, you remember Nico? He's a good friend of mine. Can we talk? Sure we can talk, as long as we don't talk too much. Interesting <laughs> times, you know what I mean? Did you hear about our friend, the guy with the thing? Yeah, you mean Harry the... guy with the hat? No, the guy with the, you know, the... but the beep the poop. Yeah, the guy with the... and the... Yeah, that guy. <laughs> the way they talk. I heard. So be cool, Ray. I heard. Listen, I need to speak to you alone. Yeah, Phil, see, that's the thing. I kind of know what you're going to ask, and I can't. What do you mean you can't? I can't do it, Phil. I got a lot of interest right now. Business is really taking off, and I don't want any distractions. Well, as you can see, I got my own issues here. Look, Nico is good. He'll do what you need. And you say he's a friend of yours. Sure. Hmm. Good to meet you. Yeah. Come here. Yeah. The triads have this big chunk of brown they're desperate to get rid of. Talking about it all over town. Wanting to offload it at any price. They think it's cursed or something. Oh. Prove it is. Take it from them. It's loaded into a truck going to Franklin Street in West Dyke. Get a hold of it and give me a call. Sure. But Mr. Bell, it's going to cost you. You got it. No problem. Great. Say, nice stereo you got there, Phil. Thanks. Yeah, so Philly, you ever hear from your ex-wife? What kind of question is that? Just ask it. Get the hell out of here. <laughs> Every time, this <laughs> motherfucker. Mm. So how do we prove that it's cursed? I'll be in touch, Nikki. Okay. I want to get this car, actually. Because <clears throat> mine is on crack, clearly. Look at it. It's like that poor Marlene. Marlene? Marlene? Arles? I don't know. What was her name? Anyway. Oh, talking about ba 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 <laughs> Why am I stuttering? Talking about Merle. Ah! Sorry. Um, as you guys might know, I am w watching The Walking Dead still currently. I watched it since, since it first came out, but I started re-watching it more recently because I just got behind. Um, and I saw that Norma Reed just posted that they wrapped up filming. They wrapped up filming forever. They just filmed the final. <laughs> and I was like, ah! Thank God I have Disney Plus, because otherwise, obviously, I don't have an AMC subscription. And I don't even know if it's working in the UK, because a lot of American sites just restrict access to all European countries. Doesn't matter who. <laughs> um, so I don't know if AMC is like that or not, but yeah, uh, The Walking Dead is definitely on Disney, so got that. Um, it's quite cool. I think we're halfway through the show. I'm not sure because it's like a long show because usually they do like 13 episodes. But not now. They're doing 24 for the final season, which is good. But apparently they're going to do a spinoff with uh, Negan and Maggie, so that's going to be interesting to see. Hopefully it's as, it, it is as good as... Do I have to get on my car? As good as, obviously, The Walking Dead Dead. The Walking Dead Dead Dead. The Walking Walking Dead. The Dead Dead Dead. I don't know what I'm saying. <sighs> Kill the guys or what? Oh, the big one. Okay. Gosh, there's a, it's a lot of them. It's a lot. So if we kill them, then they think it's... Tell me, game. What the heck do I need to do? Steal the truck. I don't think. Can we? Can I sneak? Because otherwise, why would he have his gun out? Okay. If the truck starts moving, then that's it. I'm gonna do you! Get the wall, man! Ah! 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 
Thank God for auto aim, hey. Because I could, I would not see them. Oh wow, everything's exploding. Oh my god, I just realized maybe I'm gonna get by accident. Okay, you like. Okay, that doesn't work. I need to get more guns, man. Okay. I think I need to get a bit closer. He's aiming at. He's, he's, there's clearly a guy there, but. I'm going for you. Where's that the guy? What the fuck? Oh, okay. <laughs> I did what I was supposed to do, I guess. Make your way to the front. How? Okay. Come on, Nico. How how am I gonna do it? Okay, oh we're going up this up. Come on, come on, Nico. Come on, I'm pressing as hard as I can, babe. Oh my god. To climb back, go climb back, Nico. Climb back, Nico. Come on, Bridgen. To advance, okay. No, no, uh, uh. okay, okay. Try it. Try so you, try you have. Okay, okay. Go up. I'm pressing. Okay, so I'm counterbalancing. Obviously, with what Nico does. Okay, come on, come on, Nico. Come on, Nico. Come on, Bridgen. I don't know. I'm I'm saying I'm talk I'm trying to talk like Jacob talks. Come on. Come on. Come on. No, no. Oh, oh for fuck's sake. Oh my god. Oh my god. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. We're almost there. We're almost there. We're almost there. Yes! Hell yeah! Ooh, frickin' heck. Frickin' the dickin'. Okay. Well, this is interesting. Everybody out of my way. Phil, man, I got that thing you were after. What do you want me to do with it? It's a wedding present from my nephew, Frank. Take it out to the big house over Beaverhead Avenue. You know the one I need. They'll be waiting for you. Okay. Oh, we're gonna find, we're gonna see a mansion, eh? I feel like there's no mansion comparable um, with the mansion in GTA 3, right? The big one, you know which one I mean, the one where the last mission takes place. I can't remember their names because there's so many like gang members that have different things and but they're, they're all Italian for some reason, so. But yeah, you know which one I mean, you know which one I mean. Well, at least we weren't far from where we need to be. This is the disappointing mansion. Can I add that? <laughs> hey, you Frankie. Your uncle asked me to give you this wedding present. You're a lucky guy. I don't know about that. I gotta sit on this stuff until Phil gets over his paranoia and we could ship it. Meantime, I gotta pack it into some cars that go faster than this thing. Sounds like a fun honeymoon. Later on. Oh, I thought he was gonna say, I have a job for you. Get me cars, get me fast cars. I thought I was gonna say that, but I'm glad he didn't because I ain't doing that. Guess we're getting out of here on this bike, huh? Wow, I've got a lot of money. I don't know why they didn't put like properties. What is this? Assassin? Wait, what? What? Is this an assassin for Nico? Like, is this on Nico's... <gasps> is that a thing? 
Okay. I don't know what that is, so but let's just go there and see. Your nephew's got this wedding present. Nicely done. He's a good kid. He deserves something special. Hopefully you'll look after him. Nico, you looking for more work? I'm always looking to earn a bit of extra cash. Great. I know a guy who needs a man like you. What Only fuck? operates on an outside line, though. Go to the payphone on the corner of Vitulo and Hardtack. He'll call you. Great, thanks. Taxi! Ah! Fuck on! How dare you! No, 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 no! Give me! Get, uh. Oi! Where are you going? Just give me in! Okay. He actually stopped for us. I didn't, I didn't appreciate that, right? So I'm just gonna go to that assassin's fight thing to see what it is. What he do. Because <laughs> I'm just wondering if he's actually... If we pass by, will he try and oh, kill us? Thank you. Answer. Nico, oh, it's like I a car job. He oh, wants to meet you. Phone. Does he got work? Yeah. He's got stuff that needs doing. Okay. Head over to his house off of Beaverhead and West Dyke. Sure. Okay, but first, just want to check this out. Taken out. Uh, hello. I'm a friend of Fields. Nico Bellic. I know who you are, brother. Oh, already? Oh, so this is Just it? Like everyone else in this city. Okay. What's your deal? People Convenient. come to me when they need something handled. I come to people like you when I need someone handled. Right. Do you get me, brother? I get you. When you've taken care of something for me, call me on my cellular, but no specifics. Phil's good at that. I only talk business on a hard line. The target is in a car. They're moving around, Alderney. Take them mm. out. Okay. So... What am I looking for? Your contact left you with weapons, armor... Okay. For each job. Okay. So yes, it's like a payphone mission. That's what we used to have in... Um... Can I just... Okay, thanks. Um, that's what we used to have before. In GT Vice City and 3 and whatever. Okay, I think I was talking about the mansion, and I think in my head I was talking about Vice City. Um, not GTA 3, but whatever. Okay, I need a car. You're gonna have to to do. No, well then, give me the car, bitch. Get out of the car, ugly, man. You get don't want this face, to get ugly. I will. Don't worry. I just need your car. Thanks. Is that a better car? I don't know if they're faster or whatever. Anyway, Turn right. we'll see. I have to say, I don't know if it's gonna be a type of where I have to kill loads or just one. Because if it's just one, why would it give me armor and stuff? You know what I mean? But I guess we'll see now. I wonder how many we have to do. Because they were there in, um, in the other older games, there, there was a certain amount and you would finish them. So I don't think they keep going, but... Oh well. Stop the convoy. It's a convoy. Fuck. Fuck, baby. Fuck. <laughs> okay. 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 Um, I don't know how. I don't even know that they're... They know I'm chasing them, so... They're coming right here. Oh, I'm dead. This is harder than I thought. Maybe I won't do it today just because... Eesh! Excuse me. I don't have enough time. Oh, but I wanted to, but I kind of didn't want to. What's Jay on the map? Hold up. Because he's literally right here. Jimmy Pegorino. Okay, let's just quickly do him. I'm not going to do payphone things. I... I... Oh, no, no, because the police. Oh, my God. I almost got in that car. Let's get this one. Oi. Oi. Stop. 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 Give me the car. Give me the car. Give me the car. Give me the car. This is on hidden camera. Yeah, you're getting pranked. Um, what else did I want to say? I want to say something, but I forgot. Anyway. 
Jimmy it is. Yeah, I didn't, I couldn't be bothered to do it because it looked like a lot of hassle. I, I now know why you needed an armor. Ooh, these houses look really nice. Hey, Jimmy. Jimmy Pecorino. Pecorino Romano. You need to wear smart clothes and smart shoes in order to meet Jimmy. Does that mean I don't have smart shoes on? Are you fucking kidding me? Well. Let's crap that. Um, gonna go on a date with Carmen. Okay? Uh, let's call Carmen. Go on a date with her and then hopefully... Hi there. Shit, Nico. Carmen getting some sleep. Call her back after 1 p.m. Oh okay. my god. Sorry to disturb 1 p.m. So everybody has like a sleeping schedule. I know Bruce is 8 o'clock. Um, mm -mm. Let's go with Logic. Fixer. I don't remember Fixer. I don't remember most of these names. Kiki? Is that Ma uh, Is that... I think it must be, yeah. Logic. Hi, Kiki. I'd uh, like to take you out. I've been thinking about you all day, Ooh. Nico. Pick me up in the next hour. Hell hey, yeah. yeah. Okay, how far away does she live? Wait, where is she? She's quite far, yo. Um. So... I have a I have a thing. Let's test my theory out because you guys know that I said that because I'm in a certain part of town when I order Roman's cab, it's always this one guy that comes and picks me up, picks me up. But um, let's because we're in a different, a whole different part of town. Let's try and see if we get a different driver. See if the, the hey, Roman, theory is you correct. Send a cab for a cousin in need, could you? Wait right there, MB. I'm dispatching one now. A cousin in need. Oh, there you go. They're coming, I think. Hopefully right in front of me and I don't have to go anywhere. But yeah, I... Because uh, I feel like I saw a Serbian... Not Serbian, but definitely Eastern European guy talk to me once. And I skipped it by accident. and Because then I was like, oh shit. Oh, I think... Oh, I think it's the same guy. No, I think my theory doesn't... It's the same miserable guy. Hey, angry man! You better be going somewhere close. I need to pick up some real fares so I can make real money. So, am I taking you to a big drug deal or some shit, my friend? You got a package of snow strapped to your chest? I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> what? You didn't think I was down with that game? You didn't think I knew what you were about? I done all kinds of crazy shit. I only started driving this cab to make my wife shut up. You can't go around busting caps in people when you got responsibilities. Oh, or God. Caps, you shouldn't go around busting caps in people regardless of your responsibilities. <laughs> That's fucking funny. Next thing you are going to tell me I shouldn't be having extramarital affairs. You got to do that shit to survive, my friend. Of course. And to help your survival, you should just stick to driving this car, man. <laughs> there you go. My theory is wrong. I really thought we could get a different guy, but I guess it's the same guy over and over again. Now get out of here and don't trouble me again. Okay. I think we need a car. Hold up. Hold up. I need a car and I need to impress her. I oh that's a nice car. Kinda. This is a robbery. Get out of there. This is a robbery. Oh please. I thought the police was behind me. Please don't be. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. I was a champion. Alright, do do you. Okay, but we have a car, so it's fine. Hell yeah. I kinda wanna go to the stand-up comedy thing. Just to see. Nico. Sorry, mate. Uh, just to see if it's uh, a different guy. I'm looking forward to this so much. Then Ricky Gervais. So I I know she would enjoy that. So I, I know I said we're gonna go have dinner, but this it's car's breakfast crazy. time. So Nico, you look so sweet in those clothes. Thanks. She compliments me a lot. Nico is very silent. A very silent man. Okay. At least she likes the car this time. Did she say that she likes it? I wasn't really paying attention. I was looking at the map and thinking of things. You know, do you ever... Does that ever happen to you? You just get lost in your own thoughts. 
I was hoovering and all of a sudden I was thinking of the undying of the soul or something <laughs> and uh, it just dawned to me that I finished hoover and I kept hoovering over the same place for multiple times maybe that's not such a good thing I don't know Cat Williams really tells it like it is yeah sure you do Let's hear it, Liberty City, for Mr. Cat Williams. Oh, a different one. Okay. I actually Thank don't you. know him. Thank you. Thank you very much. I let's, appreciate see, let's hear his jokes. Cut that Thank you, Liberty City. What Is a this a, an actual guy? Cat club. Williams. Let me Google him first. You are okay. kicking the shit out of the club on the other side of town. Club oh, bullshit. Yeah. I'll never play there again. It's like living in a studio. It apartment. is him. You ever been in a studio apartment? <laughs> it's ridiculous. Because it's got everything but nothing. Like, you see the living room. It's right there. There's the kitchen corner right there set up. It's just so small. You can do everything from the center. It's, you become a spider. You just, oh, wait a minute. Hold on. That's my fax machine. Got it. All right. Let me open up the refrigerator. Who, who, who left my shower curtain open like that? That is ridiculous. Somebody's at the door. Hello? Hey, come on in. Let's sit is on it? the couch. Well, it's a love seat, but you can sit. Is That's it really that small? It's just that small. I'm enjoying being here in Liberty City. It's crazy. Got to have a car here, it would seem, because you motherfuckers walk too fast for me. Liberty City. Mm. Where the fuck? Are y'all going somewhere? Is there a rave or some shit that I don't know about that everybody's rushing to get to? Three o'clock in the morning, five o'clock in the morning, nine, noon, three, motherfuckers. Just... If you're not careful, you'll accidentally be walking with them. Don't even have anywhere to go. You just gotta <laughs> ask if there was a bean machine somewhere in the local vicinity so you could get you a bean, a frap, a cappuccino or something. So you just walking like this, like, excuse me, is there a coffee shop around here? I've already passed it. By the time I got done walking, you can't talk to the girls. The girls move too fast. They sure are pretty in Liberty City, though. Pretty girls in Liberty City, but they're moving. Fuck, you, you gotta, you're like an auctioneer. To, excuse me, man, <laughs> Hi there, how you? Can we do your other husband? Hi, I'm new to Liberty. They're gone. Gone. It's moving so fucking fast. It's ridiculous. So I decided I was going to get a car, but you got to be careful. Got to be careful, because shopping for a car is dangerous. If you got a raggedy car, you go to the lot. These motherfuckers keep trying to trick you. Don't take the test drive. That's all I'm going to say. Don't take the fucking test drive. Test drive is the trick. It's to show you how much better this shit is in your shit so you can't even go back to your car again here i've been sitting on vinyl with creases on in my back and i'm <laughs> accustomed to the raggedness of the seat this motherfuckers put me in a chair i didn't even want to drive the car i wanted to watch television i was just laying there comfortable test driving test driving don't do it don't do it especially if you ain't got good credit because they become two different sales right when you first walk in they're the friendliest motherfuckers in the world make you feel good about yourself how are you sir might i offer you some popcorn some some uh, some uh, cheese uh, bits and uh, some coffee? Well, that's an odd combination, but I haven't had popcorn in a while. Don't mind if I do. Thank you. Coffee, yes. Yes, I'll have. And you said cheese bits? I don't think I'm even familiar with cheese bits. Of course I'll have them, and they wine you and dine you, make you feel good about it, and then they go in the back room and check your fucking credit and come out like you're an alien from another land. Just, sir, I just ran your credit score. You think this is a motherfucking game? Huh? <laughs> Sir, let me just say, if you had $35,000 cash, I couldn't let you put 10% down on a car that costs $9. Do you understand what the fuck? Get the... What we can do is we can recommend you to a Liberty City Transit official who can give your motherfucking ass a bus pass to you learn how to properly use credit. Y'all been great. I've been Is it actually that bad so with credit in uh, the US? It's not as bad here as, you know, if you pay your bills and you just need to get loans to have a good score, which is fine. interesting you way. Though? Are you really? Sure, I'm fine. Are you okay? Yeah, I guess so. Just sometimes I feel like I can't do enough, though. I feel like I can't help people as much as I want to be able to. Hey, you can't help everybody. You can try. Most of the people from my law class just went to big firms on the exchange to make their millions. I wanted to help people. That's why I do pro bono work at City Hall. I defend the people that the rest of the community has forgotten about. It sounds as if you're being as helpful as you can be. If I got hauled down to City Hall, 
I'd be grateful for your help. Yeah, I guess I do make a difference. I feel like all my life I've been given things by my parents. Cars, clothes, my apartment, my education. I help the people who haven't been given anything. I represent the people who can't even help themselves. It might be because I feel guilty, but is that a bad thing? Am no. I doing it for the wrong reasons? It doesn't matter why you do something, as long as it's right. Thanks, Nico. You're welcome. Let's see if we can get in your panties now, even though it's 6 a.m. Try your luck. You're both adults, <laughs> Kiki. Why don't you ask me into your place? This is going to be amazing. I might cry with happiness. All right, then. Oh, hell yeah, baby. I can't believe Carmen is not the easiest one between the two of them. Like, who are we joking? Like, Carmen seems like she would pop her legs out, you Why know, for you in a second. Anytime. Oh, Nico. <laughs> Nico. It's Arlen. I love... Oh, is that it? She doesn't get too attached. I hope she doesn't get too attached. Well, there you go, you guys. This episode has been a bit of a mess, I have to admit. Um, From A to B to C, like, we tried to do that. I can't believe I don't have good shoes on. I thought I did. <laughs> But whatever, I'm gonna go and try and change. Then me, Jimmy, Pecorino. I remember them talking about him now. Um, them talking about him? Wait, didn't we? Oh my god, I'm confusing names already. I told you I'm so I'm not good with names. Anyway, we'll see who he is and what he does in the next episode. Not even sure if I want to attempt the assassination mission. Just let me know in the comments below if they are worth it. If not, I'll, I'll just leave them. Just like the driving ones i'm not really good at that um yeah comedy clubs i need to check out to see who else could be at the comedy club and then maybe i could take you know i don't know carmen um i thought there was a different chick that i could date um but i couldn't find anybody i literally i think i messaged everybody and um nobody came back to me saying yeah i want to date you but hey, this is where we're at. In the next episode, we are hopefully gonna go get Bernie's car that he says he has for us. And then go from there. I don't know what's gonna happen because I keep changing my mind. <laughs> but that's how it is with the open world games. So thanks so much for watching. Make sure you leave a like and subscribe. And we'll catch you in the next one. Bye.